<laughs> Happy not to see us now. now. <laughs> You're gonna miss us, son. Look, what are your thoughts as you pack up and head home? Oh, well, you know, go get better. Uh, keep working. That's all it is, really. You know, it's pretty much the same approach I take every off season. Same approach I took. Uh, you know, we went to, after we went to the playoffs. So it's, it's one of those things. You just uh, go back and keep working. Pretty much it. Is there anything good you will take from this year? Uh, yeah. I mean, there, there are positives, and it's uh, you know, it's we dealt with a lot of adversity this year, both uh, team wise and individually. And uh, you know, it just helps you to. Uh, Really be thankful for what you have and not worry about what you don't. And, you know, it's uh, like I said, it's just part, you know, something you can't really worry about, move on and get over it and deal with it. Look, you're not signed as long as Bronny is, but you talked about the importance of doing this rebuild the right way and, and it could take some time. What's what, what are your views on just where the team is right now and how long it might take to get back into contention? You know, it's hard to put a number on it. Uh, obviously, you don't know what kind of moves uh, they're going to make in the off season. You know what kind of free agents we're going to get. You know, you can't really put a number on it because you don't know. Uh, I don't even know about the prospects in the minor leagues, how far away or how close or whatever. I don't know that stuff. So, you know, I just guess it's kind of a wait and see type thing. And uh, you know, whatever happens is going to happen. It's just kind of got. Like I said, I don't worry about that stuff. So I just go and work out and work hard and just try to get better. One thing the, the franchise seems to have is a lot of young pitching talent for the first time in a while. You've caught a bunch of them and around a bunch of them. What are your thoughts on some of the young guys you've seen? Oh, well, you know, obviously we have ability and talent, and uh, we just need to harness it and get consistent with those strikes. And, uh, you know, I know overall, um, you know, young guys, when they get called up, I mean, not very many guys are really successful out of the shoot. You know, you have a few that are, but for the most part, guys are battling and struggle because they have to adjust to the, to the big, big game. So um, hopefully, like I said, you know, this is a year we have learned learn from, and hopefully those guys learned a lot from it. And so that'll make us better down the road for sure. How do you think council handled this? What's that? How do you think council handled it? I thought he did good. You know, we came in and, uh, you know, I like, I, you know, I like counts and uh, played with him when he was here. And, you know, I definitely respect him. So I know a lot of guys respect him because they know that he's been there and done that. And uh, he's a winner. So, you know, I think that he did a good job, and I'm excited to see what he's going to do down the road. What do you think the main thing this team is missing this year? Well, first of all, we had a lot of guys, you know, that got hurt. We got off on a bad foot. And, uh, you know, when guys go down, main players go down and get hurt, it's obviously hard to recover from. You know, we have just to figure out how to battle through it. You know, and we did. We fought, we fought through it, but it was very difficult, especially within our division, you know. You know, in 2011, I remember we didn't, I can't remember anybody getting hurt in 2011 off the top of my head, you know, anybody big. So, you know, the health is such a big part of being successful, you know, along and staying consistent throughout the years. Thank you. Thanks.